Gives you a lot of cooking space, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. It's a little pink yet. When it gets done, we're just going to put the cheese right on it on there? Yep, and then we'll just put it on and then tent it mm. like that. So two will be ready shortly, but then I'm going to do the rest. Like, I'll do a large batch. I just wanted to test it. Okay. Yeah, they look like they're coming along good. So it doesn't take long, probably three minutes. So. Yeah, when it's sli sliced thin like that, it cooks pretty quick. Yeah. Show your dad how much fun we have. Yeah. What do you say? Hi, Chip. I said I don't care. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> no, he said that's good. I wasn't sure how, how it was going to be. I told him. We were dead center. <laughs> we're not to the side or anything, you know. Where's the macaroni and cheese? Oh, right behind that. the plate back there. It was good, Carrie. It was? Did it turn out just like, did yeah. the cheese whiz melt in that? Yeah. How is it, Carrie? Me? Good. How is it, Mardell? Good? I don't know. You're good. <laughs> there you go. Oh, do you want peppers too? No. Something different, wasn't wow. it? <laughs> okay. So, what kind of cheese did you use? Okay, you decide your cheese yet? Cheese Whiz uh, Swiss, and provolone. Yeah. Mozzarella or cheese Whiz. Or you can have more than one cheese, like right? some people did. <laughs> did you have a deviled egg, Mike? No. Oh my gosh, how is it? Very good. Wow. <laughs> I think you'll like the provolone. <laughs> Okay, Laura, you're up. Like, hurry up and taste it. Did you get on the waiting list, Mike? Right. Yeah, I'm on there. Well, Mike's next, too, so I can do two. Did you get on the list, Laura? Jeff doesn't want cheese whiz anymore. He was just going to take it if nobody else was taking it. Oh. Well, what kind did you want? Oh, my gosh. I'm sorry. I'm... No, that was fine. No. I'm a cheese whiz. He's, he'd rather not have the cheese whiz. Okay. Cheese whiz. <laughs> what kind of cheese does he want? Any, or none? Mozzarella. Mozzarella. Should be slices of mozzarella. Yeah, there. Probably have to open it. It's not open yet. We can get it. We'll open it. Mozzarella. Yeah, next time after they slice it, we should trim the fat off. Maybe. Yeah, there's just some pieces with a little extra fat on the end. If it's there, pick it off. I'm not offended. Because I've been, I've been shredding it myself. I'll take the extra. That's good. Yeah, that's the flavor. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so let me get another one on and then the cheese. Hold on. That griddle works out pretty good, don't it? Mm -hmm. Ooh, nice. It's a nice big cooking space. Don't tell me I'm supposed to tell you. Me? No. Oh. So it's like each one of those things a pound or what? Or less? No, they're like a quarter pound, I think, each mm. one. We'll probably have quite a bit left then. Yeah, I think we'll have. We could freeze it. Yeah. What's that? Cammy yeah, said you're getting a food fattish with all the grills. <laughs> the grill meat. <mate. laughs> <laughs> Got to keep all your options open. Got now four, five of them. There's twelve. Well, I got three. Two of them are his, though. The gas grills are his. Okay. Oh, uh, Mike's on the, the cheesesteak wait list. And my mouth is watering as I'm waiting here. It's, it's good. So what kind of cheese did you use? Cheese was No. Swiss. Oh, I bought the Swiss because you wanted it. 
I'll eat it later. I bought it for the cheese sticks. <laughs> hey, you should make eggs and put that in there for a breakfast sandwich. Hey, yeah. Uh, fried eggs. Hey, steak and oh, eggs. Oh my gosh, sandwich, yeah. Come on. What? Drop that one piece that's hanging on. I better grab it. <laughs> oh, what kind of cheese do you want on yours? None. <laughs> You're having one or not? I thought you weren't going to have one. You think I'm joking over here. I'm ready to dive on it. You want peppers and onions? Uh, Man, that looks like something you get at the fair. Oh, my God. I don't know how to attack it. <laughs> oh, you'll find a way. Yeah. Smells good. Yeah, it does. Put some salt. Look at all that cheese whiz gobbed in there. I don't know how to get it close. He said loaded cheese whiz. <laughs> Jake, I'm sorry. Peppers, no. Plain. No. Plain. That explains why I'm just holding this plate. Jake's a man after my own heart. I don't go for that crap either. I don't know. Look at that. Stringy cheese. Woo! Mm. Well, Mike, what's the verdict? Mm. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's really good. Man, yours is loaded. Is that onions or is it? No. One onion on there. Yeah, yeah, one got mixed in. Provolone and Swiss, right? Yeah. Provolone and Swiss. Anybody want chicken? No. Can you have a? So you were able to you were able to eat it. I ate it. What do you want? Paper towel? Yeah, please. I would have been. Can you get me one? Too? This was different for a cookout, huh, Mike? Mm -hmm. Something neat to try, anyway. Thanks. <laughs> Jake one and one. What do you think we'll have to do it again someday? Maybe not again this year, but maybe next year we'll do cheesesteaks again for a cookout. When I read your text, I'm like, uh, cheesecake on the griddle. Cheesecake? <laughs> I'm like, what? No, I said cheesesteaks, didn't it? I did, but I read cheesecake. <laughs> I'm like, what is that? <laughs> have too many Allen pies. <laughs> yeah, we're not making those tonight. We didn't get... You can probably put those on this. Probably. Yeah. Make more of them instead of... <laughs> but the campfire just gives us something special. I don't know. <laughs> crazy. Mardell, did we even get stuff for s'mores? Like, I'll eat it later. Okay, anybody one second? No, I'm, I'm gonna have some uh, macaroni and cheese and stuff, but those were pretty filling. Last call, and you can mine now. Did Laura get one? Uh, hers is right here. Oh, how is it, Larry? Good, huh? Did she ask you about Vanessa? No. Oh, no, God, he doesn't. I know that. Carrie, can you do one for Janessa? Sure. Do you want a torpedo or a regular roll? I don't think she would eat a big one. She wouldn't eat a full size one, would she? Mm hmm. Oh, maybe Mike could take the other half home. Steve, I have it now. Oh, I don't think it would make it. Two more things. Should I just cook them up and you have leftovers, or do you want to cook them fresh? Well, you know what I mean. We could freeze them, I guess, because nobody's going to eat them right now. No, I meant there's only two more steaks. When I take this. Yeah, I, I'd rather just Eat freeze it and make it some other time. Do you need anything? But... That worked out pretty good buying a steak like that. Yeah. I'm glad they sliced it. Or did you say you could slice it like that? I could have if they didn't put in. I could have done like the season art, but they probably they... probably be easier for them, huh? So. Next time we'll uh, trim the fat off of it, for, you know, like before we cook it. Yeah, this is a little bit of extra. Well, some of these guys like the fat, but I don't. No, I don't. no the fat kind of is. Uh... Well, I think it's better if it cooks off and you grill it. Huh? Later on, later. Yeah, oh, well, that's true. How is it, Mike? What's the verdict? <laughs> yeah. Is it like a fair cheesesteak? Yeah, it's crazy. 
Yeah, it's better than the fair cheese steak. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, did it taste good? Like, I don't even know what this tastes like. It's amazing. So he was... Well, neither do I. Oh. <laughs> there you go. And the fair cheese steaks will cost you like eight to ten dollars. <laughs> this is uh, an experience. <laughs> How was it, Jake? Good? Mm -hmm. That's all right. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's all right. I think it was a little more heavy than Here, you can use it. Oh, do you want to talk about the onions? Like that place up there in Sullivan County, the Wiz? What is that? Where you get those cheese steaks? Oh. Big Mike's? Oh, oh yeah. Forksville mm -hmm. General Store. What? Last call. I'm making the messes, so. He serves it with the wings. What, what time is it, Laura? Huh? 6.30. We got a little time. Yeah, we're going to make a fire when we're done eating here. You want another one? Oh, is it raining again? Mike, do you want uh, another one? She can make it. Mike's got the, or, uh, got the fire store. Do you want another one, Mike? Well, she has it going. If you want another one, I'll put it on now. It's not a good deal. I want you to eat, though. Hey, you want, you want no, just put no, it on. No, 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 I'll get it going. Mike, then there'll be no it on It did? <laughs> if they can eat it, use it up, but... <laughs> Oh. So we got that steak for less than half price, huh? Or no? Than, less than half price. Yeah. It was like 60... I think it was, no, seven... Like 65% mm -hmm. off or something like that. That's a good deal. Yeah. Because we got... Yeah. There's alcohol on there. We got it for a good price. How do you that one? Because I was trying to negotiate other other cuts for a lower price, and he's like, "You're getting a really good deal right now." <laughs> so, what do you think? You like this griddle? Yes, I do. It's pretty cool. See, now eventually the whole thing will just turn black from usage. That's why they call it blackstone. But this is only really a third time I used it. <laughs> Although it turned blacker this time. Yeah, like especially up here. Yeah. It'll That's be like, like, an, like a cast iron. Well, they say eventually you keep oiling it and keep cooking on it, it becomes like a non, like a non stick surface. Like. I gotta try to put shims under it though. It's not a set and level. See how all the grease yes. is going to that back corner? And I'm pushing it to the front, but I'm yeah, still so making we a just mess. Gotta, I gotta put like some wood shims under it or something to level it up. All the grease goes to that back corner. Well, it's supposed to go into this little thing here and then drip into that tray on the side. But Mike is going for an unprecedented second one. Can he do it? Since he almost bit my finger, I think he can. Cobra Kai. <laughs> Did you watch that or not? Started to. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. Larry, you ever watch the rest of that Cobra Kai? No? Oh man, that whole series. That whole season was excellent. Yeah. How much time do I have? I think June 7th. It's, if, if I don't know if I'm keeping it or not. Probably cheese whiz. I might. Yeah, but I might keep it. I don't know. Because I know June 7th, I want to watch it again. And it, well, yeah, not till 2019 now, though. Oh, I Thanks, told Carrie. Ashley I'd make her plate. Mark, I got make her plate with the cheesecake? Yeah. And she needs a I don't know. salad and a girl. Uh, that's actually, yeah. I see that. Do you want? We can do it. Uh, Janessa, I'm about it. Yeah, we can oh. do that. Caught the biggest fish. Oh. Yeah, I said I never caught one like that. Oh, that was okay. <laughs> see you later, Carrie. <laughs> we need to come out here and watch movies by the fire. Yeah, everybody sometime. felt early tonight. Yeah. I thought it was going to be uh, going off, but it was tough. Uh, yeah, I thought it was going to be so dark. Well, my mom and them went in because it's getting cold. Yeah, it's weird. Yesterday was 90 and today it's... Today was... Yesterday was so hot. Yeah, I don't like that. I like 75, 70. 
See, did I tell you we put electrical on that deck over there and yeah, cable TV? Terry was telling me, um, yeah. There, there's one there, one over there, and one Go. here. So you're pretty quick. These twinkle lights are nice. What kind of tree is this with the red leaf? That's pretty. I don't know. Is that a is that a smoke tree? I think or something. It's called. That is a really pretty. I think it's called a smoke tree or something. I was down at Berlin's today. You have a lot of nice see stuff. Hey, see you, Carrie. Oh, see you, Carrie. Oh, hope you feel better, Tyler. Come back when you can't stay so long. Next door was talking. I think it's a frog. <laughs> you thought it was the guy next door? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Are you coming to sit with us, Bill? By the fire. Oh, he's outside? Yeah, right here. Oh, oh, what well. happened here? Are you going to replace that stone? Yeah, I'll have to. I, I had the chair. Uh oh. In between. Right there, see that hole? Uh huh. I had it in there, I didn't realize I was sitting, all of a sudden I just kept going over and over and over. <laughs> like, you're always going deep in the ground. Yikes. My dad said about taking all these bricks up and leveling them, but I like the way it is. I was going to tell you, there's a um, girl yeah, that I've uh, been there's It a looks, makes it look like rustic, like, I don't know, like the old, reminds me of the old cobblestone tree streets. You don't want a perfect one, right? Yeah. It reminds me, like, before they before they put blacktop down, if you see yeah, those cobblestone, yeah. yeah. They should have kept portions of the, what, this? Yeah, probably wouldn't be so many potholes. <laughs> it's nice. Yeah, I'll have to replace that one. I didn't, it wasn't like that, it just. Probably just over the winter. Yeah. I think it just happened since then, or since then, because the broken pieces there. I just swept it off this morning. Yeah, maybe there was a chair that got in that room yeah. or something. They had a closer and closer to that. Well, you are the closest to it. Yeah, but it wasn't me. I didn't have the chair that close. Anyhow, um, like I was saying, there's a girl that I follow, Garden Answer, and she, three days ago, put down a patio at her sister-in-law's house. They dug eight inches down. They used a, a um, what's it called? Eight inches. Eight in Yes, eight inches down. They took a sod thing and cut the grass out. Then they dug. I want to say it was eight inches. Maybe maybe it was two inches of sand. No, two inches of gravel, two inches of sand, then the pavers, and then the pavers were three. Yeah, no, I think I'm right. You know it would have been cool if you had a brick and cons in there. Yeah. Get one from Cons, one from Orange Street School. <laughs> yeah, that'd, that'd be cool. Would have been cool to have one from that Marcus Street School before they built the library. Yeah, just like any kind of. And Borough Hotel. Oh, that would have been epic. You have all these little. Dude, you could still say you have them. We just don't know it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you yeah, could be like. This one's from Cons. This one's from. Cons. <laughs> this one's from... That's right. Line don't cost anything. <laughs> Hey, speaking of which, your dog park's supposed to start the pavers soon, I guess, putting them. Yeah, I saw that. I rode up there the other day with my bike. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. Uh, they were getting ready to lay the cement down. Yeah, they did it now. I saw the pictures. I thought that's where they were putting the bricks. Like, I thought they were going to have, like, the bricks. Going. I don't know how they're doing the br uh, pavers yet. I don't know. They haven't said, really. They said a paver area, so I don't know. Well, I think if you lift it up, let me know, because I'll help you. I was fascinated. What? I was really... We're not taking the bricks. What? No. Bricks for the dog park? No, oh. not for here. <laughs> no, I'm not doing that. I no, like the way it is. Because it is unleveled. Like it's kind no, of. No, he likes that. He that's likes what we that. just saying. Yeah, that's what we just if discussed. You're have more problems like that brick. Oh, you're not going to have problems. Because the more raised ones up. I don't want it all level though. I like the way it looks like this. It looks it's like. It looks, looks really old that way. Yeah, I see what he's saying. I do like it. It's weathered. It's aged. Yeah. What you know are you complaining what, about? Nothing. You know what I like too is bricks, people that have those driveways with brick and moss. Do you ever see that? No. 
you can actually walk on it. It feels like a... Well, these like get moss on it, but I always put stuff on to kill it. <laughs> no, no, not... Wait, what did you say? Moss, like see over there how it's yeah, dead? Yeah, how it's green? Yeah, well, it's brown now because I spray it with stuff to kill it. But Not that kind of moss. It's the moss that grows in between, not on the flat surface. Yeah, right there is one. You see it? Yeah, 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 right there. Yeah, that's what you're talking about. Yeah, but it's on the brick. No, oh, it's yeah, supposed yeah. to be. Oh, yeah, yeah, You mean right in between. Yeah, yeah it right. has to be in between the brick, not on the brick. Yeah, that looks good, too. I think you got the girl in between. I keep it there. I don't What's know. Right I here? just think it looks pretty. Right here. Yeah, you got a little bit in between it. I like that look, but green, <coughs> but not on <laughs> the frog. Yeah, I don't know. Green moss on bricks can. Well, it gets silky. Can be a slippery. Oh, watch on the other side of the wood pile over here. Some poison ivy I just sprayed. Oh, Sweet pickles. Are you sure? Sure, Bob said get that. You sure that's not what he has? And he's just like so. being a badass. And no, I don't think so. Because like, he he bad. actually had poison last year, and he was really having a hard time with oh. it. So he'd know if this was bothering him. Poison is a is a pickle, especially especially if you spread it on yourself in other places. Like you have it on this arm, but you're you're scratching. Yeah, if like you get this. it on your balls. Well, that too. <laughs> <laughs> a nice moist, damp area that it really is. <laughs> oh shit! That sucks, Steve. Has that happened? No, I never. <laughs> well, I don't. I, I, honestly, I don't think I ever had poison. I don't I know if I can get it. Oh. Ice roll around. I might. I had something last year that might have been poison. I don't know if it was though. I'll probably get it now, but I mean, I didn't get it when I was a kid. I was able to go in the woods and oh. never have a problem. Yeah, I mean, I we were in the woods all the time, yeah. camping, or me and Jeff back in those woods, but there, I never got it. You know how, like, there's levels My of the poison did. ivy? Like, you know, there's, like, poison ivy, then poison oak, poison sumac. Yeah. I think I'm on, like, the higher end of the poisons that it affects me, because I only, because I used to kayak a lot. Now, you poison mean, sumac or whatever it's called, how, do, you, do you just touch the leaves? And yeah, like you just, you just, you just. Because when I was a kid, I, I brushed right up again, the leaves brushed right across my face, uh -huh. and I didn't get it, so. Nothing, it's the oils that secrete from the leaf. You could have, and I got it on my, I got them on my sides of my legs. <coughs> and it's really gross, because it was like bubbles. It was like, ugh. Oh, Pops, you should have just let that there, we'll get it. Well, it's there. <laughs> okay, he takes it out. Of him. You can't he tell him. He's done now, so get up and do it. He don't listen. Look at Chip looking out. Yeah. I like your uh, hat flag over there. That's cute. You see it? Oh, the cat flag. Hat flag. Hat. Oh, okay, that. Oh, you do have a cat flag too. <laughs> he's, hang he's hanging. Too many rhyming things around here. It seems like that. A lot of red, white, and blue in this backyard. Yeah, it looks patriotic. Fourth he's of July red, coming he's up. He's got a red bush. He's got a blue spa. Oh. I like the black mulch. I think that looks nice. Mm -hmm. Larry just put down some black mulch yeah, I at the house. Yeah, to get the one before you figure out. I doubt he'll reorder Do you have anything. potting soil? Yeah. Because I need, I might come down for a bag tomorrow. I bought four bags of black mulch. I bought um, some tomato plants and some yeah. jalapeno pepper plant plants. Come at like one o'clock when I'm on break so I don't have All to right. load it. <laughs> I will. I will. Are you yeah. coming to sit with us? Not very long. Aw. I gotta get my medicine. Look at Chipper on his shirt. Uh, I know, I said, look, that's awesome. Did you get him for Christmas? Yeah. It's a nice shirt. Huh? It's a nice shirt. Thank you. It's got a little dirty though today. Mine did too. Got little splatters. So how do you like that grill? I like it. Yeah. Cleaned what? up nice afterwards too. It did. What what else should we griddle? I don't even know what <laughs> you grill pork chops. Google it. You grill uh, ham slices. Oh, we should do portobello mushroom steaks. <coughs> let's go let's go vegetarian people. I wanna do a, I wanna do a brisket on my Traeger. You're gonna smoke it, are you? Smoked brisket. And, uh, I had a notion to get uh, some mushrooms today. You know, you could have had mushrooms on those. Have, with those steaks. Oh, that'd have been good too. Yeah. Okay. Swiss cheese with mushrooms and oh my goodness. Did you make your sausage or not? Yeah. Oh, well, that got eaten too. I had some. 
I did not have a piece. I'm sorry. That's all right. Chicken all got going. People really like the chicken. Yeah. They were eating that early. I only, uh, I wasn't going to make, I didn't make a lot. Like one small pack of sausage. Mm -hmm. And uh, one, was, uh, one, I got the legs separate and, uh, and the thighs separate. And uh, I got another one of the legs. But I figured maybe that was a lot of legs, so I figured I do not use that. And so it all got going, so that's good. All the sausage got it all eaten up? Uh, there was a couple of uh, some left yet, but that's tomorrow. That'll I'll be good. Some of that tomorrow. The beans was almost gone. That surprised me. Wow, you had beans? I didn't even see them. Yeah, I had baked beans. And uh, they, uh, they was all but gone. And, uh, I was going to throw them out, and Mardell says, can I have the rest of them? I said, sure, because uh, there was enough for her to eat, you know. Mm -hmm. Then, uh, then uh, you what know. What is that? Softball. They, they got a system that pumps it right out of their basement, like, his you system and stuff. that much stuff. water in the basement? Yeah. It's like a oh. fountain over there. That's That's been coming out like that every day, every... 10, 15, 20 minutes for four straight days. Carrie, Carrie just like that. It's just going right back in his basement. That's what Probably. he thinks. Probably. But see now, like right about where we're sitting, my grandmother grew up here and she said there's an underground stream that runs right through here. Mm-hmm. Wow. Larry's. No. Because that stream doesn't come up this far, so it doesn't. There's a well, you know, when you walk into my shed, over here with the refrigerator. That, there's like a metal plate there. You see that cap? That's a well. Yeah, I know what you mean. That's, that's a, a well. In the Everybody used to say it was the best water around, too. My grandmother said, like, back in when she was young, people would come from all over town to get water here and fill it up, There's fill up water. jugs and stuff. I was going to put a pump on it. And, you know, just... can, you, can you have a well in town now, or no? You're not supposed to, but no. I'm not filling it in. We were wondering that the other time. Yeah, there was somebody getting a well. Like the... It looked like they were getting a well. I don't well, know. Well, now there's a difference. They can get a well for heat pumps. Uh, uh, that's a way to go. I would love a heat pump. Because now you take a lot of your businesses will run heat pumps. You're right. You do. You do have to well 200 see? feet down, huh? just like a well. You're right. Uh, I just seen one being drilled in, in, in a yard someplace. Yeah, so it front street or right across from the school. Could Some, be. Somewhere, yeah. That's where it was. Yeah, it was across the street. Yeah, it was in the, well. the old... Um, I'm like, they're digging a well? I'm like, what the hell? Yeah. They're getting geothermal. Wow. Well, that's what that building that built where Cons was, eh? Did that geothermal heat. Did they? Yeah. Do it if you can. Get off the oil and the gas, because it's cheap to do the geothermal. If you're building. But, uh... Yeah, retrofitting is a little expensive, but... Yeah, if you're building, definitely. I know yeah. if I build, I'm doing it.